I got a little fog on here. Just brought it out in from the air conditioning. But you can see what they're doing here today in Chemtrail City. See, covering the sun. Let me get some of that condensation off there. Yeah, and you can see they're putting down a new trail right now. Sure. Look how it turns it black. It. One, two, three, four lines of black over there. And today, uh, last night we got torrential downpour. Today uh, we're going to get 90%, it says here, torrential downpour. There's one way to hell back there. Over there. This is about normal. It's uh, 1030 or so right now. They started about 6 o'clock in the morning and you can see how it's little blacks over that way you can see them filtering out over there the chemtrails there's another one fading away let's see if that was a contrail coming out of that airplane right there as you can see well it'd be already gone by now and we have right now uh, 92 degrees so it's very hot it's not cold up there in that air right there and look how low he is jets are way above the clouds usually 35 40,000 feet anybody can tell that's where they are is jumping at a uh, altitude maybe two miles nowhere near five or six miles So, look at that line out there. See, whatever they're putting down today, it's got something in it. Probably a lot of nanoparticles. That's usually what turn, turns black. And as you can see, they're putting them all right in a row here to get in front of the sun. So, it's only regurgitators denying, denying regurgitators. They want to believe there's no such thing as geoengineering, cloud seeding weather modification they're ignorant people very ignorant the same ones that are globe tards usually because they've never been anywhere on this earth they've never been to the hundreds of salt flats they've never been across the flat ocean or on any lake they've never built anything therefore you have to use a level and a plumb bob everything on earth escalators all the way through to foundations to your kitchen sink and your toilet has to be put in level so but they're 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 ignorant deniers to the truth of reality around them there's no hope for those type of people they're just like i say most of them are paid shills or just too ignorant with no comprehension so they'll never smarten up it don't matter. It doesn't matter. They can stay in their comas. Us truthful people, honest, with integrity. We know what's going on. Poisoning our water, our land, and our air. That's exactly what's going on. Poisoning people's arms. Playing the big lie on people that are no comprehension, no critical thinking, no common sense, and no logic. Those are the retarded people.
yeah, we're going to have rain coming here very shortly. As you can see, this is what happens when they do this right here in front of the sun. Hey look, a spaceship all by itself in the sky. This is what it looks like down here right now. We had a lot of heavy chemtrailing yesterday here in Chemtrail City, D-Land, Florida. And, uh, of course we just had torrential downpour and you can see up in there they've already started laying another trail in there you can see one right there and they don't wait too long and then uh, I've been hearing disbursement bombs up above the clouds when it's raining uh, a lot of people don't know about that they just know about chemtrails when it's raining, uh, they also, a lot of people, uh, I think they believe it's uh, thunder, but uh, you can tell the difference if you've been around bombs before and thunder. That, uh, no, it's not thunder. There, just had to wipe my lens off. It's disbursement bombs. Probably nanoparticles. And, of course, it... When they put it above the rain clouds, it uh, comes down quicker on the earth. Okay, you fine folks. Enough spaceships for today. Bye-bye.